Hello guys, welcome in my video and in this video I am going to teach you 20 important English questions which is important for NDPC exam, SSC etc. So I am going to start from first question. First question is, there are four different words out of which one is correctly spelled. Find the correctly spelled word. So here is four words and which one is correct. That is one you need to find out. So here is answer is your warmer. Because grammar is wrong, grammar should be G R A W M A R. And coaching is wrong, coaching should be C O A C H I N G. Humor is wrong, so humor should be H U M O R. So here answer would be warmer, W A R M E R. So let's move on on next question, question number two. Same thing here also, you need to find out one right answer so there are different four words restricting promoting narrowing animation so restricting is right answer narrowing should be n a double r o w i n g animation is wrong because animation should be a n i m a t i o n so this is wrong promoting is also wrong because promoting is p r o m o t i n g double t should not be here so it's wrong so our right answer is restricting Let's move on on third question. You are expected to remain silent in the class library. So here preposition you need to use in, in the class library. So your answer is in. Let's move on question number four. Choose the word that best express the meaning of the word grasp. Grasp. Grasp is an expressed kind of understanding thing. So same meaning would be understand. If I, I am going to teach you something, if you are taking it, if your understanding is means that you are grasping it, you are taking it, you are understanding. So, best express uh, the same meaning of grasp which understand. So, our answer would be understand. Let's move on on question number 5. Choose the best antonym for the word appreciate. So, antonym of appreciate would be criticize. Because if you are if you are doing well, if you are doing great, people will appreciate you. But to some people who will criticize you, right? So this is totally opposite of appreciate. Appreciate. So antonym of appreciate will be criticize. Right? So let's on question number six. My friend said that it was not an easy examination. So here vowel and pronunciation is also vowels. So you can use here N, not a not the so here answer would be n my friend said that it was not an easy examination right so let's move on on question number seven there are four different words out of which one is correctly spelled find the correctly spelled out of these four option so here answer would be cl cl paper is wrong paper should be p a p e r so this is wrong cl is right Pulse. Pulse should be P U L S E. Pulse. That's why it's wrong. Grain should be G R A I N. Grain. So it's totally wrong. So our answer would be cereal. C E R E A L. This is our right answer. Right? So let's move on. Question number 8. Choose the best antonym for the word reserve. Reserve. You know, if you are in a bus or train, there is a bus, a seat, some seat are reserved means that somebody is already taken or seated on that right so you can't sit so antonym that means opposite word for reserve will be emptiness emptiness means something is empty where you can sit where you can whatever you can so opposite or antonym of reserve will be emptiness right so move on next question question number nine choose the word that that best express the meaning of the evidence evidence so same meaning it means synonym of evidence synonym of evidence would be testimony testimony same meaning will give you testimony of evidence so incident is not related to evidence police is not related residence is not related to evidence so right answer would be testimony let's move on on next question question number 10 choose the word that best best express the meaning of the word emerge Emerge means something is coming to show you, see you, I mean appear you. So same meaning would be appear, emerge. So synonym of emerge would be appear, appear. 
Let's move on on next question, question number 11. The committee declared him unfair for the job. So here, article we will use the or the, T-S-E, the, the job. Let's move on on next question, question number 12. Choose the word that best express the meaning of the word capacity. Capacity, you know, capacity means there is something that shows that you can do something. You are, you are having this much capacity, right? So capacity or ability express the same meaning that you have ability or you have capacity to do something, right? So our right answer will be ability, ability. Let's move on next question, question number 13. Many. That's a student. Many a student because here is a singular thing. Singular thing means many a student fails. The difficulty in choosing the correct answer. So here would be a our right answer, right? Let's move on. Next question. Question number fourteen. Choose the best antonym. Antonym for the word mandatory. Mandatory. So if mandatory antonym for mandatory. If something is mandatory, you have to follow that. But if something is optional that means you can leave it so antonym of mandatory would be optional so right answer would be optional let's move on next question question number 15 therefore different words out of which one is correctly spelled find the correctly spelled word so factual is wrong should be f a c t u l y so it's wrong correlates it's wrong because it should be C-O-R-E-L-A-T-E-S correlates. Next is technical. Technical is right. Mechanical is totally wrong because mechanical should be M-E-C-A-C-H-A-N-I-C-A-L mechanical. So it's wrong. Our right answer would be technical. Let's move on on next question number 16. All the students distributed the papers among themselves. Right? So here our answer would be among them among themselves. Let's move on on next question, question number 17. Choose the best and domain for the word shift. Shift. So our answer would be motionless. Shift means something is changing after a certain period of time changing. You know, in some factory work is going on three shift means first shift, second shift, third shift, right? Means that something is going on, something is moving. So opposite word, I mean antonym would be motionless. That is that don't have any kind of motion. So our answer would be motionless. Let's move on on next question, question number 18. Choose the word that best express the meaning of the word successor. Successor. So here answer would be higher. Higher. Both have same meaning. Successor means both is having same meaning. So let's move on on next question, question number 19. You may return the book to me after some time. So we don't need to use any article. So here would be no any article. You can't use a sometime, the sometime, or and sometime. So here we can't use any article. So our answer would be no article. Let's move on on question number 20 and on last question. So they gifted a smartphone to their friends on his birthday. So here answer would be two, not a from four. Right? So thank you so much guys for watching this video. Have a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.